What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel! Hi, how are ya? In today's video, we are going to be swatching all of my brand new Velour Liquid Lipsticks. We're gonna be talking about a lot of shades that you guys have been begging and pleading for me to return and bring back, and guess what? Of course I listen to you guys, always. And we have brought back six shades all the way back from 2015 and onwards. A lot of favorites from you guys that you have been saying, girl, we need these shades in permanent pink packaging. So we have brought a lot of shades back for you guys and we have four brand new ones. So today we're gonna be swatching about them, talking about them and getting into the business. But before we do that, I think you guys wanna hear about today's giveaway. So in today's video, it's sickening. I'm just gonna put it out there. It's sickening. And if you are someone that loves lipstick, bitch, you are gonna live for this giveaway. So, three, yes, three lucky winners will get my entire Velour Liquid Lipstick Collection. Not just the new stuff, I'm talking every single shade on my website I wanna give back to you guys. So, and actually the more that I'm sitting here, I'm like, we've usually done like five winners, so Great, I'm changing the rules as I'm speaking out loud. Let's actually do this for five people. So I'm actually gonna give five lucky winners my entire Velour Liquid Lipstick Collection. So, oh girl, the lipsticks are already running. They're like, that many hope. What do you gotta do to enter? I'm sure you're all wondering. You know, it's really easy on this channel. All we're gonna have you do today, you guys, is make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. You gotta be following me on Twitter. If you're not, it's just at Jeffree Star. And you have to just leave a comment down below. Let me know what shade you love from this collection or in this video. Just say hi. Just sound off below, baby, and you will be automatically entered into the giveaway. This giveaway will be over on May 10th, and I will be announcing everything on Snapchat and on my Twitter, of course, and I'll put the winners in the description box. All right, you guys, if you're ready to see some new lipsticks swatched, then keep on watching. I'm just really excited today because the Velour Liquid Lipstick was my first product that I ever put out. I'll never forget November of 2014, I put out my first three shades. It was Red Rum, I'm Royalty, and Prom Night, and the rest is history, and it's just crazy how we are now three and a half years in, and my liquid lip is such a staple for so many of you guys. So before we even swatch anything, thanks to you guys for making this formula such a hit, and I'm so thankful for all of you out there that just love it. So of course, it's time to expand. Now I know I do a lot of limited edition collections. I put out a lot of colors and a lot of you guys are like, okay, honey, you put stuff in limited edition, like edition packaging, but then it goes away and we really, like we run out. A lot of people email all the time, like where's this, this, this. So I'm like, okay, let's do a shade extension for the spring. Let's bring back some favorites and let's introduce some new shades. So, all right, so we have four new shades. I'm just gonna hold up the boxes right here. You may be familiar with the names because they are from my Summer Chrome collection from last year, and they were in Lip Ammunition, which of course is my Stick Satin Lipstick Formula. So today, we bring you the new Liquid Lip version of Thick as Thieves, Skin Tight, Birthday Suit, and Allegedly. Now, these were huge last summer. They they all sold out and I was like, oh, okay. And a lot of you emailed and were like, we really want liquid versions. So if you guys remember in my Velour mini bundle that came out last year, I put Skin Tight in a mini, but now it's gonna be um, full size. So we have these ones, of course. And just a quick reminder in case you have never worn my lipsticks before, my liquid lips retail for $18. They are vegan, they are cruelty free, and they are long lasting without feeling really crunchy. The formula is very smooth like butter, but it doesn't look too crazy. They're really not streaky at all. Some shades, y'all know, are really hard to make, <laughs> like that yellow girl. When you guys get these, of course, they will be in the pink box now with the pink cap, not in the limited edition. So they are now permanent and they will be here forever. I think we should swatch the first four shades that are brand new on my mouth. And of course, I'm gonna do a lot of hand swashes and compare swashes. Swatches, bitch, it's been, a, it's been a minute. So of course, by the time you guys are watching this, all the lipsticks are live on my website, but let's get to swatching. And of course, if you wanna shop, I will link everything down below for you guys. So before we swatch the four new shades, I'm also gonna do hand swatches of all the nudes because I know a lot of you wanna see comparisons. But let's talk about the shades that I'm bringing back permanently from previous collections. So quickly, we have the two metallics, Candy Ass and Poinsettia. Now these shades were huge hits last year and we got so many 
emails and feedback like girl we need candy ass we need it all so they are back honey now I am bringing back a older we'll say vintage we're, I'm kidding it was only two years old this is from the summer 2015 collection and the shade is called the virginity it is a beautiful lilac really soft lavender now of course we have two more we have the iconic Calabasas now this one Wow, I have never sold as many lipsticks in a limited edition collection than I did with this shade and it was such a big hit. Of course, I live in Calabasas, it's my city, and we had to bring it back. Shout out to you guys because you came hard for this shade, so I'm really excited for this to be back. And last but not least, oh my god, I have never gotten this many comments, emails, and tweets about this nude. So we are bringing back Christmas cookie, of course, I had to. So I think you guys, it's time to get to swatching. Also, if you're watching this, I have a lot of lip scrubs that are back in stock. We have orange soda, blue raspberry sucker, and there's a lot of um, scrubs that you guys have been living and breathing and dying for. They're actually restocked as well. So I'm gonna take out my orange soda because girl, you know these lips need some scrubbing. Now, if you have never tried one of my lip scrubs before, they retail for $12, they are vegan, of course, they're cruelty-free, they are edible, um, you don't wanna substitute them for a meal, which some people have, but they are edible, there's aloe vera in here and vitamin E, and they leave your lips feeling flawless. And of course, if you're feeling hungry, take a scoop for yourself. Mm. So let's start with Skin Tight. It is one of my lightest nudes. Now, I have a lot of nudes in my collection, and here are some from the permanent collection that we will compare it with later. But this is a very peachy nude. A lot of people like to compare it to I'm Nude. A lot of nudes in this video. And it looks like this compared next to it. Of course, everything looks different in a bottle and next to pink, so I will put it on my hands and stuff for you. But you can see that Skin Tight over here is very nude. It is very, very nude. All right, here is Skin Tight Swatched. Like, ugh. I know it's my own brand, so I really can't be like, this is my favorite color, but I really love this nude. Um, really good for just like neutrals and smoky eyes, and it's just like, ugh, I feel very. No, I just wanna say a disclaimer that I do put a little bit of foundation on my lips, because when you wipe away, you do gotta cover it up so there's no makeup remover residue on your mouth. So that's why I look like that. Hair, what are you doing? Girl, get back there. So the next shade that I'm gonna swatch is Allegedly. Now this is a terracotta warm tone nude. It can be confused with Thickest Thieves, but Thickest Thieves is a lot more cool toned. I'm gonna swatch them all in my hands and show you guys all a comparison in a little bit, but I love this shade. It is so warm. I love wearing like lashes and a little glitter and nothing else but this. Maybe some perfume and a thong. I haven't worn this shade in a few months, and bitch, I live for the shade. All right, this is allegedly swatched. Now we're gonna swatch Thick as Thieves. It is a very beautiful brown. It has a little bit of different like undertone in there that you maybe not used to, but I love it. It is also kind of a warm toned shade. It just looks flawless. All right, y'all. Uh, all right, let's throw this hair back for a second. All right, this is Thick as Thieves Swatched. What y'all think? And the fourth brand new shade is Birthday Suit. Now this one was such a hit in the lip ammo formula, I had to do it in the liquid. Now it is in between, let's, let's do a little comparison. There's a lot of nudes here, but it sits in the family of, let's see if we can hold all of these up here. It sits in the family in between here. So it's in between Skin Tight and I'm Nude, but just a little lighter than Mannequin. So if Mannequin is too dark for you, Birthday Suit is gonna be right up your alley. Or I love taking liquid lips that are darker, like Thick as Thieves, and then putting like Birthday Suit in the middle for that little Ombre Pamela Anderson 90s moment. Here is Birthday Suit Swatched. Now, let me know down below what your favorite shade from these four nudes are, but I am gonna swatch the other colors that will be brought back permanently in case you've never seen them or you're like, girl, I need a reminder. Um, my hand is about to be covered in colors and we're gonna compare all the nudes as well because I know we're gonna get a lot of, let me see mannequin next to da-da-da, so. 
Besides those four, of course, we are bringing back Calabasas, one of my favorite shades that I've ever created, and we're just gonna do a little hi, bam, right there. There is Calabasas. Now, as I swatch these, they are gonna dry down, of course, they are all matte, whether they are matte or metallic, they do all dry down. Now, let's do Christmas cookie. Bam. And there she is. Of course, we gotta do pumpkin pie. Now, this one was so highly requested, like, girl. Come on, Christmas, I see y'all. And there is she is, oof. Now, the thing about this one, there's actually little reflex of glitter in the formula. So once it dries completely down, you can take your finger and just kind of rub it a little bit and it kind of activates the glitter and glitter does come forward and it looks very sparkly and pretty. Now we're gonna do the red metallic shade Poinsettia. I love this one, especially mixing it with like a matte. It's a wrap, bam. Very high in shine and it's definitely way more metallic, of course, than the other ones. And once it dries down, it has a beautiful red shift to it. All right, next up we have Candy Ass, which is the other metallic shade. Now this one came out last summer. Now this one is really fun. It definitely has a more moussey like texture and so does Poinsettia, as you can see as I'm putting it like on my hand. On the lips, it is very like, uh, it is like butter. A little less watery than the normal mattes. And the last shade from the collection is Virginia. Now it is a very muted lilac shade, so now this shade is very pale. I call it like a purple nude and I adore this color. So I'm gonna swatch all the nude shades now and of course if you don't hear me say something just replay it. So the first shade I'm gonna swatch is I'm nude. Now I'm just gonna start putting them down here because we have a lot of nudes. Now I'm gonna put Skin Tight next to I'm Nude and let's see what it looks like. Definitely a huge difference, but it's hard to tell until you really see them together. So there is Skin Tight. And now here is Birthday Suit. Here is Celebrity Skin, a lot darker, literally my top selling lipstick of all time. So for everyone that has ever bought a Celebrity Skin, thank you so much. Now, as you can see, that is a lot darker. How come when we swatch things, we like go down and more? It's like getting longer as we go. I think a good one to swatch next to this one is um, Christmas Cookie, because I get asked that all the time. Even though it's up here, I am gonna put it down next to the other ones, just so you can visually see it. So there is Christmas Cookie. As you can see, there's a lot more peachy undertone to it and definitely um, very different. Next to that, I am gonna do Mannequin. This is, oh, this one, look at this. This is an old one, bitch. I've had this forever. I've worn Mannequin for so long. I think it's my favorite nude that I've ever created personally. And there it is swatched. Now let's do a very dark one. This is more like a, looks like a grayish with the nude undertone. This is Posh Spice. One of my all-time favorites. A lot more muted and um, dark. Right now we're gonna swatch Nathan because a lot of people wanna know the T on the shade. Um, this is a lot more warm tone than people think, so when you put it next to other nudes, you're like, oh. So there is Nathan swatched, and I'm gonna do a few more because I think that allegedly is definitely darker, but it's still kind of close in that family, so I'm gonna put that one next to it. Bam, as you can see, that one is a lot darker than Nathan. And then lastly, let's put Thickest Thieves on here. Now, of course, you guys know I have a lot of other nudes. We have Androgyny, we have Dominatrix, we have a lot more on my website. Um, but these are similar in um, tone, so I thought, why not put at least these next to each other? So there's Thickest Thieves. Wow, these are all swatched, of course. They are starting to all dry down. Look at Candy Ass, it is so these are all the swatches. Now remember, of course, these are now all out into the world and I am so excited for you guys to finally get to play with all of them. Also, I am restocking a lot of sold out shades on my website. So like I'm nude, celebrity skin, and there's a bunch of stuff. Um, of course, you can check my social medias for all of the shades that you may not know are back. Just hop on my website, girl, Jeffree Star Cosmetics, you know what it is. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And of course, do not forget to enter today's giveaway. Thank you guys so much. I will see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye guys. Oh, and also, who's ready for June 1st? Sneak peek of the brand new mini bundle, Equality.